Tickets are on sale for KFC Radio Live. Click the link in the bio, get yours, come out and hang with the boys. And some of them, uh, uh, like, you could see them come off and they're like, <laughs> right? <laughs> and you're like, <laughs> and you go like, yeah, yeah, but you're like, you're doing... You're like seller set. Yeah, that's yeah. not. It's you know, like you're yeah. kind of like working there. I go, this is not. You're not working this room. Right. You go out there and just perform, like perform your twenty best minutes. Yeah. Right. Like actually, Don't talk put to on yeah. a show. Like yeah. do the show. And as soon as people would do that, some people would show up and they just knew they just do that. Fine. Murder. Mm -hmm. They would murder because the crowd is wants to have a good time. Yeah. But the people who were just kind of like try to like oh, oh this is just, not a big deal this yeah is not different there's yeah. a little off the cuff thing over here like <laughs> yeah. it, it just wouldn't work yeah. it wouldn't work you but know? so like uh, you really think if if you went viral uh on the internet and went from like a club to the uh you know the the demand was like a real mm -hmm. level would you you think you would say no well it's it's such a like it's a you know it's a hypothetical where you go i want like i want to but i always i mean i i always did like I still think I have like calculated risk mm -hmm. stuff in me, right? Yeah. So I think I would also work with people who would be like, let's get you some theaters in there yeah. before you do right. those. Yeah, yeah, I guess you, you don't know? have to say no. You don't have to yeah. do one or the other entirely. You I think the still... way that like, honestly, the way that that would work for me is they'd be like, hey, the, the, uh, the you have these theaters off, these, these arena offers? And I'd be like, great, say yes at like 12 months from now. Yeah. yeah. Like put them then. Right. And let me... Build work this, up. yeah. I mean, if you do, you know Matt Rife? Yeah, yeah. I mean, he went, he was doing you know normal shit, and then he sells out like a, a, a theater like thirteen times. Yeah, we had this conversation. Year, like we had him and I talked about yeah, this, and uh, he was he was smart. He was he had the awareness to do what we're talking about, okay. which is they were like do the arenas, and he was like, let me like learn do a bunch it. of theaters. Yeah, smart, and it's and it's very smart. It's I mean that's absolutely like brilliant of him to intuitively go this is a big change from the club to this theater let me do them before there's fifteen thousand people because right. then the you really can't put that toothpaste back in the tube you know what i mean you can't and you you, here's the thing check, that but if you that mid that, that yeah that that size between club and arena is going to get him first of all it's going to be a change and it's and he's going to get used to it and the that's where the set will get so tight for large audiences. Right. And then once it's tight and you put it in the arena, you're yeah. golden. Yeah. Yeah. But if you just leap to that, it is, you know, yeah, it can go sideways for sure. Right. Or it can be like, you know what, like not like that. I don't think somebody like proficient would necessarily bomb, but that you're just going to be like, that was kind of. Yeah. Not memorable. Or yeah. You're like, not going to yeah, mm. keep the momentum or whatever. Right. And yeah. you want to just, you want to go into the arenas with a tight set. Right. Tight. All right. Big thanks for watching. If you made it through this whole episode, that means you should be subscribed. There's so many of you out there who watch and don't subscribe. So make sure you are a KFC Radio subscriber. Make sure you get all the content when it drops. Click that button now. I have nine fingers. I'm still subscribed. It's that easy. <laughs>